Chapter 4 You also, son of man, take a clay tablet, and lay it before you, and portray on it a city, Jerusalem. Lay siege against it, build a siege wall against it, and heap up a mound against it. Set camps against it also, and place battering rams against it all around. Moreover, take for yourself an iron plate, and set it as an iron wall between you and the city. Set your face against it, and it shall be besieged, and you shall lay siege against it. This will be a sign to the house of Israel. Lie also on your left side, and lay the iniquity of the house of Israel upon it. According to the number of days that you lie on it, you shall bear their iniquity. For I have laid on you the years of their iniquity according to the number of the days, three hundred and ninety days. So you shall bear the iniquity of the house of Israel. And when you have completed them, lie again on your right side. Then you shall bear the iniquity of the house of Judah forty days. I have laid on you a day for each year. Therefore you shall set your face toward the siege of Jerusalem, your arm shall be uncovered, and you shall prophesy against it. And surely I will restrain you, so that you cannot turn from one side to another, till you have ended the days of your siege. Also take for yourself wheat, barley, beans, lentils, millet, and spelt. Put them into one vessel, and make bread of them for yourself. During the number of days that you lie on your side, three hundred and ninety days you shall eat it. And your food which you eat shall be by weight twenty shekels a day. From time to time you shall eat it. You shall also drink water by measure, one-sixth of a hin from time to time you shall drink. And you shall eat it as barley cakes, and bake it using fuel of human waste in their sight. Then the Lord said, So shall the children of Israel eat their defiled bread among the Gentiles, where I will drive them. So I said, Ah, Lord God, indeed I have never defiled myself from my youth till now. I have never eaten what died of itself, or was torn by beasts, nor has abominable flesh ever come into my mouth. Then he said to me, See, I am giving you cow dung instead of human waste, and you shall prepare your bread over it. Moreover he said to me, Son of man, surely I will cut off the supply of bread in Jerusalem. They shall eat bread by weight and with anxiety, and shall drink water by measure and with dread, that they may lack bread and water, and be dismayed with one another, and waste away because of their iniquity.